All right, this is Travis Wood at Grover Real Estate. I am here at 314 Range Street. It is an absolutely beautiful, sunny summer day um, here downtown Manistique. You can see Range Street right off there in the distance. Um, really nice street. There's a lot of really beautiful kind of historic homes, lots of curb appeal in this area, um, close to all the shops, restaurants, schools, churches. And of course, the beach and Lake Michigan is just right down the road. But anyway, I just want to kind of come in and spotlight this property. It just hit the market yesterday. Um, really, really cool house. It's got lots of space. So if that's something that you're looking for, this could definitely be the property for you. Um, so you can see we're entering from the back of the house. That's just kind of where I parked. So um, enters right into the kitchen. I figured this would be a good place to start. So we will head on inside and you can see we enter right into the house. If you come to the left here, there's actually a nice dedicated little laundry room in here with some um, nice closet space. So it's kind of neat. You've got your own little laundry area to kind of keep it out of the way from the rest of the house, which is great. And as soon as you walk in, this is my favorite part of the whole place. This is an addition that was put on um, and it's really, really nicely done. The windows are in incredible shape. They all look basically brand new. Look at this nice bay window uh, looking out over the backyard. Yard is absolutely massive, as I'm sure you can tell. We've got the garage right there, which we'll check out at the end. But the kitchen is um, really, really attractive. The cabinets and the countertops are all basically brand new. Um, sink is in really good shape. And then the fridge is just right here to the left. And then of course you can see this little room back through here is a bathroom on the ground floor. And you have a walk-in shower there as well. This bathroom is humongous. I'm not sure if you can tell how big it is in the video. Anyway, so back out into this kitchen area, you've got more than enough room for a dining room table here, but there's also a couple of rooms through there that could serve as a dining room as well. So you definitely have flexibility. Um, you'll notice the white radiators on the floor. So those are um, for the natural gas boiler. So the property is heated via natural gas boiler heat. Um, and the boiler is not new by any means, but it's still in good working condition. Um, probably won't have to be replaced anytime too soon, but definitely something to consider down the road. But as I walk in through here, you can see this is really a cool house. It's got some really unique features. Um, the walls are kind of curved right through there, which really makes quite the impact when guests come over and come in through your front door. Um, you can see beautiful hardwood flooring in here. I think it would... Um, benefit from just getting sanded down and restained and resealed. It would look great. But huge rooms in here. It looks like nine foot ceilings. We've got more of those kind of really cool curves. I don't know if you can tell. There's some areas in here that are gonna need trim, but it's nothing that's too major. I think it would all be pretty, um, pretty doable to take on. Right off the side here, we have um, what could be used as a ground floor bedroom with the rest of the bedrooms all located upstairs. So we'll say this is number one, bedroom number one. We've got a little storage area in here, which could very easily be turned into a walk-in closet. And we're kind of going backwards, but I think you kind of get the idea. This is the main entry of the home. You can see some of those really beautiful historic woodworking details, um, the old kind of vintage doorknob and all that, just really kind of a cool space and beautiful old stairway. So this is the entry. And then we'll head up the stairs here. And I love the upstairs because it's um, almost reminds me of like a hotel or something. You've just got a long hallway and then all these bedrooms just kind of flanking off to the left and the right with a bathroom at the very end. But here's another bedroom. So we'll say this one's bedroom number two. 
Definitely would want to refinish the floors up here. Um, I think it's just a little bit of adhesive. There was probably carpet or something in here at one point. Bedroom number three. Bedroom number four. And bedroom number five. So it's not every day that you see a five bedroom house in Manistique or really anywhere, I can tell you that. Right at the end of the hall here, we have the bathroom, which is huge. You've got a lot of uh, storage under the eaves for additional clothing storage, and then a shower tub combo. So we'll kind of do another quick breeze through the house, and then I will take a step outside and show you the garage. All right, so we are gonna head out and check out this large garage. And wow, it's a nice day. Definitely feels like summer. It's a beautiful time to look at property. But as you can see, there's a really long driveway, so you've got tons of room to park. If you had guests over, maybe teenage kids with cars of their own. Look how big this garage is though. I mean, I don't know if it really uh, translates to the video, but it's humongous. I mean, it is huge. You could park definitely at least four cars in here and there's plenty of room for storage, for woodworking projects. Um, yeah, all your outdoor gear, outdoor toys could all fit in here really, really easily. All right, I think that pretty much concludes our video. Um, again, my name is Travis Wood with Grover Real Estate. I'm here at 314 Rain Street here in Manistique, Michigan. Property just hit the market yesterday, listed for 159. It's got five bedrooms, two bathrooms, massive garage, large city lot, uh, natural gas uh, boiler heat and a beautiful brand new kitchen. If you have any questions about this property or any other properties, you can feel free to reach out to me. My number is 906-450-5080. Thank you very much and have a great day.